is Terry with Computer Pro. On the E-Link phones, we ran into an issue. These are T54Ws, which is a popular phone. We love them. Um, built-in Wi-Fi, built-in Bluetooth. Uh, but every now and then, they either through corrupt firmware, during an update, power outage, whatever, it'll get stuck. This one's been booting for like a couple minutes. It's stuck at the welcome screen. And the only way we found out, we can just RMA them. That's what we've been doing. But... Um, we had to locate three specific firmware files. There's a bunch of them out there on the internet. Only three seem to work. So we put those three on a flash drive, and then this is how we fix it. We put the flash drive in the USB port. Unplug it. And unplug it from PoE or from power and hold down the redial key as it boots up. And then, which is that second key right there with the two. And then you get a choice. Do you want to boot TFTP or USB? You choose USB. Now, the files have to be renamed to T54W. So T54W.bin, T54W.rom. And there's one other one. Um, and then it restores the firmware. There's a lot of those out on the internet. But when you download them, if we had to pay attention to the file sizes, if the file sizes aren't exactly as these are, it will um it just doesn't doesn't work so then it says firmware updating do not turn power off <clears throat> so we have to wait for it go back all right it's got done now it's doing a, pull this guy a reboot pull the usb drive out <clears throat> And if everything went good, it should actually boot up this time. More than likely, depending on who you're with, it's gonna need their auto provisioning. It's gonna we have to gonna we're gonna have to put the string in. We're gonna have to log into the phone and do it. We can either have the the uh, the VoIP company do it, or we can get the string and put it in. Um, but that should recover it, which is you know, like I said, it's the same cost as RMAing it, but it's much faster and there's no shipping back and forth. And there we go. So that is, oh, the Wi-Fi is on here. Oh, because it doesn't have, oh, well, we don't have data plugged in. That's why, oh, yep. But anyway, that is it. So it, once again, it requires a specific set of files. Even though there's a bunch of files with the same name out there, they have to be the right file sizes. So a specific version. And then they have to be all renamed to T54W dot, there's three of them, one's dot rom, dot is it INF or bin. something like that dot dot bin and then RTF. rtf i believe or something but yep so that is how you restore a yay link um specifically in this case t54w um that's stuck at the welcome screen